gonna start over. Oh. Yo, yo, yo. What is going on, guys? Andrew OG here. Welcome to my hashtag Red R3. Wow. Red R3, huh? Yo, yo, yo. What is going on, guys? Andrew OG here. Welcome to my hashtag R3D recruitment challenge response. This is my biography video. I'm going in as a sniper for the recruitment challenge, so I don't really need a biography video, but I thought that it would add a little bit of personality. Who am I? My name is Xander OG. My friends call me Xander. My real name is Zane. I'm from a really small town in the middle of Michigan, so Kiwis, if you're watching this and you want to have a meetup, hit me up on Twitter at as Andrew OG. I've been playing video games since I was probably 10. I'm 17 right now. I'm a senior in high school. I plan on going to Central Michigan University. I plan on going to college for something like video game design or maybe film education or something like that like Gandhi does. So now that you know a little bit about me, let's move on to what my goals would be if I did make it into Red. My number one goal for joining Red is just to gain exposure. I think I'm sitting at 69 subscribers right now. I know it's not a lot. I haven't been uploading very consistently and I really do need to change that. So that kind of leads us into the second goal of joining the Red Reserve is to gain more motivation for doing YouTube. I used to do YouTube a lot back in Black Ops 2 and MW3. I actually posted a lot of MW3 videos last year, me red gunning and getting Moabs and stuff. This is probably the second biggest reason that I want to do the Red Recruitment Challenge is to gain more motivation for doing YouTube. I love playing video games. My internet's not good enough to live stream or I would live stream every single day playing COD, just having fun with friends and everything. When you have that large of a group of people that aren't active, when you have this low of a number of subscribers, it really turns you off from doing YouTube. When you have about 70 subscribers like I do and there's nobody that's active, you get maybe 10 or 15 views and maybe one like, no comments. It makes YouTube really hard to do. So that's why I've been taking a lot of breaks from doing YouTube because I haven't really had the motivation. So now I'm going to talk about why I think that I would be a good fit for the Red Reserve. I think that I could be a good entertainer for the channel, bring more people in with my personality and my clips. I think of myself as more of a Jev kind of person. I'm not amazing at sniping, I'm decent, but I'm not as good as some of these other people that are in the Red RC. I think the one thing that sets me apart from all these people that are hitting these crazy clips in the Red RC is my personality. A lot of the people that, that go to my school that I hang out with say that I'm really funny. A lot of people laugh at the stuff I say even though I don't try to make them laugh. I just talk, people just laugh at me for no reason, I don't really understand. But going off of that, I think I have a lot of personality to bring to the table if I were to join the Red Reserve. Ever since I've heard of Red, it's been my dream team to join. I've always wanted to join Red. I started watching all these people at the Red House. I saw that they were super entertaining, super funny, and I really think that my personality matches the people that are in Red. On that note, I'm going to end off my biography portion of the Red RC. Really appreciate it. If you guys watched through the whole video. If you liked the video, feel free to leave a like, subscribe, watch all the other content I'm going to be putting out in the Red RC. As always, people, this is Andrew G. Later.